Hey guys, what's going on? Crime here today bringing you a video of showing you how to download correctly, how to successfully download your downloadable content, your games, whatever you want to do on the PlayStation 4. Since the patch of 1.7 came out from PlayStation, uh, we couldn't, well, we don't have the retry button anymore when you're downloading something and it fails, it, it gives up, it gives up here a little cannot download message and there's no retry button so it, all the download progress that was made is lost so how to fix that well I have here some stuff that I was trying to download I'm gonna download the Warframe I don't, know, I don't know if it's like a free to play game so there it is okay so here we have it in the notifications menu both of the uh, files up the file you can just go ahead and take it away you can just let the game download so the problem is is that somewhere about 400 megabytes or so it will give me that fail message for me it might be different for you or something I don't know but the solution is let it go around 200 megabytes and then start well this is a procedure when it reaches 36 megabytes let's wait for it let's say it's 236 so but right here is barely 36 so when it reaches like 34 35 you want to go right ahead and back out go to the settings menu go to here network and check this box off so what happens it actually pauses the download there it is preparing to download 100% it actually acts like if it was pausing it like the internet connection was not like torn off the PlayStation 4 to make it actually say cannot download it's like a little pause glitch so to just get it again go ahead and check the box again back out go back to the notifications menu and there it goes so you want to do it again somewhere around 70 megabytes 65 megabytes the thing is you might kind of you might get a little bit bored and just say I'm just gonna let it do 100 megabytes but you run the risk that because you didn't do it like I'm telling you to do it it can actually fail and it's just a piece of crap because maybe it's the last 100 megabytes you had to download so right here 65 60, just want to back out sorry go over here you want to do this as fast as you can check that box off wait like five seconds here check it again and go back over here there it goes it's back to downloading that's how I downloaded well, all my games the update file the share factory the naval strike second assault China rising cruiser hangar map pack the call duty ghost game so we're here the whole call duty ghost game I downloaded it like that so it does take more time but yeah it's the way and here you want to do it again when it gets to 100 so it's 36 70 65 and then 100 you want to do it again so yeah you have to stay here practically I don't know two hours or an hour for each game to download but you're, you're gonna get it downloaded so that's what we want I personally don't care I prefer this than actually having to put the thing to download from scratch and just hoping it that successfully downloads instead of this procedure that's kind of safer and it is successful I mean you guys can see it here I have Battlefield 4 installed and see if I can give you that one's this this one is downloaded download status completed share factor completed everything that I've downloaded by this method works it's perfect and I really recommend it to you guys um, yeah so that's practically it that's how to download the stuff remember just check this box off you can actually check your connection speed and see how much like seconds it takes to get to 36 megabytes and just wait here with a timer just be doing this instead of going back to the notifications menu and checking it and stuff it is good though because sometimes it will glitch and stay at that preparing to download 100% screen and so you can just check it on and check it back on check it off and check it on I'm sorry and then we'll just get working again. 
one thing though don't get scared if right when you check off the box let's say for now and then boom right away the cannot download message appears usually on the left corner left upper corner uh, that's because like the pause glitched somehow but it still works just go ahead and check the box again and just go check it and it should be downloading it perfect or you have to press X and there will be a retry button again so I'm telling you like this is a hardcore glitch because we're making it like forcing it to download the stuff so there you go guys this is how to download the stuff with games DLC whatever you want there it is uh, ghost I couldn't get my devastation pack there it is all installed everything good to go and yeah that's practically it thank you guys catch you in the next one